No way. Prince William furiously shouts at King Charles over royal titles. In a royal family where decorum and etiquette are paramount, the recent reported clash between Prince William and King Charles has sent shockwaves through the media, igniting a firestorm of speculation and intrigue. The headline itself reads like the plot of a gripping drama, but this is real life, complete with royal tension, family dynamics, and, of course, the weighty legacy of the British monarchy. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. The crux of the matter revolves around King Charles's desire to bestow new titles upon certain members of the royal family, a move that Prince William allegedly vehemently opposes. The scene is set for a classic battle of wills, one that pits tradition against modernity and family loyalty against the weight of duty. While royal titles may seem like mere formalities to outsiders, they carry immense significance within the royal sphere, affecting everything from public perception to financial stability. William, the Duke of Cambridge, is no stranger to the pressures of royal life. As the second in line to the throne, he has always been acutely aware of the responsibilities that come with his position. However, the prospect of expanding the royal titles has raised his hackles, leading to a confrontation with his father that has left observers stunned. To understand the gravity of this situation, it's essential to delve into the historical context of royal titles. In the British monarchy, Titles are not just a reflection of status, they are steeped in tradition and expectations. Over the years, the royal family has seen its fair share of title changes, often in response to political or social shifts. However, this proposed expansion of titles comes at a time when the monarchy is under intense scrutiny, with discussions around relevance, modernization, and the future of the royal family at the forefront of public debate. Prince William is reportedly concerned that adding more titles could dilute the monarchy's standing and complicate the already intricate web of royal duties. His worries are not unfounded, in an age where transparency and accountability are demanded, the royal family has to navigate its legacy carefully. William's insistence on maintaining a streamlined approach reflects his desire to protect the monarchy's reputation while ensuring it remains relevant in modern society. Picture the scene a heated discussion in the opulent surroundings of Buckingham Palace. King Charles, with a vision of a more inclusive royal family, believes that bestowing titles could foster goodwill and strengthen ties with various factions within the Commonwealth. He envisions a monarchy that embraces change while honoring tradition. In contrast, William, who has always valued the integrity of the institution, is adamant that this move could lead to chaos. You can't just hand out titles like candy. William is reported to have exclaimed, his voice echoing in the Grand Hall. The tension between father and son is palpable, a clash of ideals that reflects the broader challenges facing the monarchy. The media has had a field day, with headlines speculating about a royal rift that could have far-reaching implications. As news of this confrontation made headlines, public opinion was divided. Some sympathized with William, praising his commitment to preserving the monarchy's legacy. After all, the royal family has long been seen as a symbol of stability and continuity in British society. Others, however, rallied behind King Charles, arguing that the monarchy must adapt to remain relevant in a rapidly changing world. Social media exploded with reactions, memes, and debates, illustrating how deeply the monarchy resonates with the public. Discussions ranged from the merits of royal titles to broader questions about the future of the monarchy itself. Many expressed their frustrations with the institution's outdated practices, while others defended the traditional structures that have endured for centuries. This conflict between William and Charles raises important questions about the future of the monarchy in a modern context. As society evolves, so too must the institutions that represent it. The royal family has been grappling with this reality for years, attempting to strike a balance between tradition and progress. The ongoing discussions about royal titles are just one facet of a broader conversation about relevance, accountability, and the role of the monarchy in contemporary life. William's vision for a more streamlined monarchy aligns with a growing public sentiment that favors transparency and accessibility. The younger generation of royals, including William and his wife, Catherine, the Princess of Wales, have made strides in this direction, engaging with the public on issues like mental health, climate change, and community support. 
their approach resonates with a populace that increasingly values authenticity over tradition. Should this disagreement escalate, it could have ripple effects throughout the royal family. The dynamics between William and his brother, Prince Harry, who has already stepped back from royal duties, could be further strained. Harry has often criticized the monarchy for its rigid structures, and William's stance may inadvertently align them more closely. The media frenzy surrounding these familial tensions only adds more fuel to the fire, creating an atmosphere of uncertainty. This situation also presents a unique opportunity for reflection within the royal family. It could lead to a re-evaluation of what it means to be a royal in today's society, prompting discussions about the roles and responsibilities of those who occupy these historic titles. Charles, as the reigning monarch, has a chance to shape this narrative, but it must be done with careful consideration of the family dynamics at play. As the dust settles from this explosive confrontation, one thing remains clear, the British monarchy is at a crossroads. With Prince William standing firmly against new royal titles, and King Charles advocating for a more inclusive royal family, the stage is set for ongoing debates about the future of this storied institution. The clash between tradition and modernity is not merely a familial dispute, it symbolizes broader societal shifts and the challenges faced by institutions that must adapt to survive. Whether this disagreement will lead to lasting change or simply become a footnote in royal history remains to be seen. In the end, the world will be watching as the royal family navigates these turbulent waters, hoping for unity, understanding, and a vision that honors the past while embracing the future. As we continue to witness this unfolding drama, one thing is certain, the saga of the British monarchy is far from over, and the next chapters promise to be just as captivating.